Hi, okay, now I'm gonna go talk about our other batik paintings, which are the small, medium, large, and long size. We have lots to choose from, hundreds of different, I think seven or 800 different designs. These here are what we call the small size. And we have them in categories. If you've ever actually been in our booth, these this category here is all um, ocean designs. Here we have different cats. Oh, that's the same cat. Um, different cats, birds, different fish here. These are different animals, different African and Indonesian designs. And this here is a different kind all entirely. These are done with uh, using the Janti tool and making little white dots as the border. And this one is called a black line design where the black would be the last thing put on the, on the batik. And um, these are really interesting. Lots of different, different ones in here as well. That's our small size, which is about 18 by 20 inches. And then we have a medium size here, which we have uh, quite a few of these as well. Dragons, cats, fish, penguins and elephants. Hang on, let me see the elephants. Here's one of the elephant ones. Dragonflies, flowers, and Indonesian designs as well. These are the long size, which we have in, this is the black line that I had talked about. And these are some other long ones. We've got lots of different possibilities for these as well. This size is a large size. And um, again, we've got lots of different ones, just a few showing here. The large size is what I used on the back of this jacket here. And I've got um, iron on crystals on these to make it sparkle. And this is the um, called the perfect panel jacket. On the front of the, per the perfect panel jacket is a medium size cut in half. And then also I've done the, used the holographic thread and put the, the iron on crystals on there as well. Um, I'd, I'd like to show you some of the things we have here on the table and some of the patterns. This is a pattern that we have. I can't find my sample right now, but it's called the Evening Star. And it's a large size star that uses, um, it uses these uh, heavyweight double-sided stiff interfacing. And then we also have the Holiday Snowflake, which is a three inch and five inch size. And that uses um, heavy weight uh, under one, heavyweight wonder under. Under wonder. <laughs> um, this is, um, a bag that I've had for a long time. This uses the uh, one of the 12 inch boutiques cut up. And then the fabrics are, um, are our own fabric and the paraffin crackle fabric on here as well. These are called the, um, the, um, duffel bag. Oh, shoot. It is the not so classic duffel bag. 
This uses two of the uh, small size boutiques on here, the horses with uh, some of our fabric as well. This is, I believe this is a medium size batik and she uh, decorated it with iron on crystals. It's really pretty, she did a great job. Um, now I'll show you some of the things that we've made with using the batiks. I know I've shown this one before, the lighthouse, the, yeah, the lighthouse with the, with the mini lighthouses in the 12 inch. And this is the, the pattern for that. And also with that pattern, I made this one out of a long, a long mass, but using a long mass batik. I used the same, um, it's the same pattern, but different things. And I'm, I'm really looking forward to finishing my lighthouse one so I can start embellishing this one. This is a, this is a long, um, table runner that a friend made for me, for me from one of my, um, seconds, but this one would be really great cut up and used in that same type of design. I can see many possibilities for this as well. This is a small size boutique, the BD 14, and I used holographic thread on here and uh, just did a lot of thread work on here around everything. And this here is the Mingle Borders with Sunflower pattern using a small size sunflower in the middle. I'll show you some of the ones we have hanging over here. Um, This one here is the mingled borders. You and I used a small size dragonfly in there. And all the fabrics are some of our cotton fabrics. This one here is the uh, Sunset in Paradise pattern where I use the six inch um, kanji, red kanjis and a, and a medium size Sunset in Paradise. This one is called Curved Arrows and it has a small size in the center and all the fabrics around are cotton fabrics that we have. This is a, a medium size and it's been all beaded. And this is, um, I think it's BF 118. And um, this was, they did a beautiful job on this with beads and some ribbon as well around the butterflies. And this here is the chain link stars using a medium size a uh, penguin, and then all the fabrics are our fabrics around the edge. So I think now we will go on to some, if anyone has any questions, feel free to shout them out to us. Thank you so much for watching.